Hey guys, so I thought I'd update you on how I'm going up here. So this week has been probably one of the hardest weeks so far. Um, it started off really well. I had my sister coming down from, actually coming up from Sydney. She came to visit me because I'm in break at the moment at uni. So I'm not studying, so we had time to just catch up. So I took her around, showed her some awesome cafes. If you saw my Instagram, I posted all the places we went to. It was so much fun. And then on the Wednesday, so she came on the Sunday. She left on the Wednesday midday, took a flight back to Sydney. And um, the rest of the afternoon, I just potted around here. And then in the evening, I got a call from my mum saying that our, our beautiful little dog she had to take her to the vet because she's been quite sick for the past few weeks and I have been quite worried about her but she kind of picks up and down and will kind of get better but then drop again and get worse and so it was kind of happening for a while. We gave her antibiotics because I thought it was just gastro but it was just not getting better and so she took her to the vet again and this was yesterday and so um, the vet like, did a scan and they found that she had like a big hole in her gut so I think it was like a tumour had that was just not discovered before it had ruptured or something and left a big hole in her gut and so they said that it could operate but there's like a because she's quite old she's 11 um, there's only like a 50% chance that she would make it and it also caused her quite a lot of pain in the recovery and it, it didn't work out the last kind of moments of her life would be quite hard so we decided as a family not to do the operation and instead um, last night at about 9.30 we put it down and I Skyped through so I could see her in her last moments but yeah so some of you guys who've been watching for a while you will you know Ari um, she's been in some of my vlogs in some of my DIY videos and she's been with our family for about 11 years, as I've said. And, oh, couldn't ask for a better dog, but I'm sure all dog owners feel the same about their little puppy. So that's been really hard, actually. So, yeah, it's just it's hard because I couldn't be there. That was probably the hardest thing, was that I couldn't be there in person to say goodbye. But thank goodness for, like, FaceTime, <laughs> you can still be there over technology. Yeah. I thought I'd update you because I know some of you guys have been following me for quite some time and you will know Ari and yeah I thought I'd just share that and share how I'm going share out my little update but yeah I thought today it's just like a little veg out day I'm gonna go to the bulk food store and collect some supplies it's like a zero waste shopping store I'll share in another vlog my experience of visiting that and all the other zero waste places I go for shopping just as a uh, an organic farmers markets and things that I visit while I'm up on the Gold Coast in case you guys are interested. I want some ideas on places to go as well. But I'll be visiting the bulk food store to collect some of those like um, um, items just to make cookies with. That's why I was like, that is all I want to do today. Make cookies, have a tea, and just literally probably just like cry in my bed or watch a movie. But yeah, so that is pretty much my little update. I thought I'd share with you, it's just a quick little video. A little, I thought I'd do a little tribute at the end to just show some clips. In case you guys are new and don't want to know my little beautiful girl. <laughs> so I will share that at the end of the video, but yeah, that's pretty much how I'm going. Otherwise, I do start uni soon. I start on the 5th of July, so in a week's time. So, so luckily when I came up here, my orientation was just before the end of term. So I had my orientation day on the Friday and that was the last day of term. And so I've had a couple weeks break just to settle in, go look for a job and things, and I start back in a week's time, which is exciting. But yeah, do let me know if you guys want me to do any other DIY tutorials in some future videos. I will do a poll on Instagram, so do keep an eye out for that as well, on any ideas you guys want me to do. I'll share some of my own ideas, and you guys can decide which ones you want to see. But yeah, thanks for watching today, guys, um, and yeah, I'll keep you posted on how I'm going up here. So, I don't really know how to wrap up today's video, it's just really sad, but yeah, I thought I'd just share that, just like I said before, so in case you guys who have been with me for a while, keep you posted on how everything's going. Yeah, I'll see you guys again in my next video. Bye.
reduced to carrying her because she refuses to walk. I don't know why. She says sometimes she's a bit temperamental. So now I'm just gonna <laughs> take her like 100 meters up the path and hopefully she'll start walking then. She's such a princess. There we go. Slow start, but we made it in the end. Dog doesn't care if you're rich or poor, clever or dull, smart or dumb. <laughs> give him your heart and he'll give you his. <laughs> 